Hey everybody, as always, I hope you're doing well out there. Today I'm gonna to be doing a quick video to walk you through how to take a screenshot using your Garmin Instinct watch. Now, I'm using the Garmin Instinct Solar, non-tactical. It shouldn't matter which version of Garmin Instinct watch you have, they should all have this feature. I'm also using the watch as delivered from Garmin. I haven't made any adjustments to any of the hotkeys. So honestly, this is a feature that I'm not sure I would ever have a need to use. I think the most common reason you would wanna take a screenshot is on the Garmin Connect app, whenever you do an activity, you have the ability to load photos from your activity. So sometimes that might be, you know, you taking a picture with your phone of the scenery, but it can also be a screenshot of your watch face to remember something about that given activity. So I don't know what other reason you would use this for, but I'm gonna show you how to use it nonetheless, just in case you're interested. So the first thing we're gonna have to do to use this feature is we're gonna have to set it up as a hotkey. Now I've done videos in the past about how to do hotkeys. I'm gonna run through this really quick. If you don't know how to do a hotkey, you might wanna review that video first before we go into this. But to do a hotkey, all we're gonna do is press and hold the menu button. Then we're gonna arrow down to settings, press GPS to select settings. We're gonna arrow down to system. We're gonna press GPS to select system. And then we're gonna arrow down to hotkeys. Now, when you get your Garmin Instinct watch, some hotkeys are already defined for you from Garmin. For example, if I hold the GPS button, it's gonna bring up my GPS. If I hold the back button, it's going to take me into my set options. If I hold the down button, it's going to take me to my ABC, which is my altimeter, barometer, and compass. But there's some uh, hotkeys that have no definition. For example, the GPS and down button is off. The GPS and up button together is off. We can pick any one of those and we can set up the screenshot as one of those hotkeys. So I'm going to do it with GPS and down. If I press the GPS and down button, what do we want it to do? While I'm on GPS and down, I'm gonna press GPS. Currently it's off. We can use the up or down button to navigate through all the different options we can set up for this hotkey. And that's the one we're looking for, screenshot. We're gonna press GPS to select it. So now if we press the GPS and down button, we will get a screenshot of our watch. So I'm gonna press the back button. I'm sorry, the set back button. I'm gonna go all the way back to the main screen. And then all we have to do at this point is find something we want to take a screenshot of. I don't know what, uh, let's see, maybe I want to send the weather forecast to somebody. I want to take a picture of this. So all we're going to do is press the GPS and down button at the same time. And you'll notice it says screenshot taken. So I've got my screenshot. So now what do I do? The way I retrieve that screenshot is I have to plug my watch into the computer and go into the Garmin folder to retrieve the image. And I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. Hopefully you're gonna be able to see this okay on my computer. Let's go ahead and plug the watch into the computer. I'll show you how we can retrieve that file. Okay, so I hope you're gonna be able to see this okay. At this point, all I've done is plug my Garmin Instinct watch into my computer. And then normally it should open up a file folder for you, but if not, you're gonna to, to wanna to navigate with the File Explorer option on your computer to this PC, and you should see a subdirectory drive it says something like Garmin Instinct, or in my case, Garmin Instinct Solar. We're gonna double click on that. And then we're gonna look for a folder that says Garmin. We're gonna double click on that. Once we get into our Garmin folder, we're essentially looking at all of the content on our Garmin Instinct watch. There's a subdirectory called screenshot, S-C-R-N shot. That's gonna hold all of the screenshots that you've taken with your watch. I'm gonna double click that. And you can see there's only one file in here, it's a BPM file, which is an image file. So you can open that to view it. And there's the screenshot that we took earlier on my watch. Again, I don't really know what you would do with this, but you've got an image file. You can load it to your Garmin Connect app, uh, load it to an activity. You can email it and do whatever you want with it. But nonetheless, that's how you take a screenshot using your Garmin Instinct watch. As always, if you've got any questions, post them in the comments. I'd be happy to help you out. And thank you for watching.